Hey folks, it is a little before 1 p.m. on uh, here on Tuesday, and officially we are, you know, going to be moments away from hitting our goal on Kickstarter for the Mobile Observatory project. We are fifty dollars away from hitting the goal, and remember, Kickstarter is one of those all-or-nothing uh, type deals where if you don't hit your goal, nobody gets charged, and there's obviously no funding. But it looks like with uh, 21 days to go. Well, uh, you know, well short of our completing our fifth day, we're probably going to hit our hit our goal here very soon. I just really wanted to say thank you to everybody. This has been absolutely phenomenal. Um, I'm going to go ahead and screen share here. I've tried to do that before, uh, and it hasn't worked out phenomenally well in the past. However, hopefully it'll work this time. And if not, uh, you can just go to observatoryproject.com and um, the link to the Kickstarter page is right there. And I think I'm just going to sit here until we get that, uh, that last $50 so we can just kind of make it official. Uh, I was hoping that uh, I'd get to do this before my wife had to go back to work. Um, my wife just left a few minutes ago. Uh, I can't wait for all of you guys to meet her not just on video but uh, in person as we go all around the country uh, can't wait to shake a lot of hands it's going to be absolutely wonderful um, even though it is uh, as a matter of technicality not yet uh, funded we can pretty much consider the mobile observatory project to be a go and uh, really just wanted to thank you guys for everything now given the fact that we do have so much time here. Uh, I would really appreciate it if you guys uh, kept trying to share uh, share this project. Um, on observatoryproject.com you can see uh, that the enhanced uh, project budget includes some things that would really really make uh, really make this project uh, you know take it to the next level I guess you would say. But anyway uh, <laughs> If you hear uh, some vibrating sounds, that would be my phone. Uh, I'm my everybody I know is kind of doing a little textathon right now, saying it's uh, you know it's so close, it's so close. This has been a very very interesting experience. I never really ex uh, I never really expected this to happen as quickly as it is. It's pretty amazing. But anyway, um, just some quick things. If you guys did pledge and you guys did get a reward, like a name slot, once the campaign is over, and don't forget that's not until April 8th, which uh, at this point kind of seems like uh, forever away. But when the campaign's over, everyone will get a message from me through Kickstarter uh, essentially asking what exact name you want to put on there. Now, it could be your name. Uh, a name of a family member, some kind of dedication like that. You could put your business name on there, uh, a, w a short web address uh, if you want to do that. Uh, I probably won't include the www because that's understood. And uh, if it's like a hundred characters long, uh, I probably ask you to uh, figure out something else. But that will be coming when the campaign ends. So uh, I know that we've gotten that question a lot. And uh, apparently Kickstarter's dealt with stuff like that before, and they've got a pretty good little system. And so, believe it or not, the way to, um, and I know a lot of you have been sending emails about this, the way to make sure that uh, your name gets in the system and it can't be forgotten is to make sure that you respond to that email when you get it. Anyway, uh, I see the universe is, you know, playing a nice little taunt Ben right now as we're still sitting here at 34,950. I'm happy to sit on here as long as we have to. Sorry, went back to the Google Hangout. A couple other things about the tour. Um, if you have suggestions about where we should go, if you, um, you know, whether it's uh, something you think we should go see, something you think that we should go maybe even report on or maybe it's just a good tour stop and you you know you'd like to toss the hat in the ring for 
<laughs> and I'll stop for a second. We have just hit our goal, folks. The Mobile Observatory Project is a go. Thank you all so much. So since this is officially a go and we will be going out there and I, I really do, uh, you know, I'm kind of an old school guy and I, I love the handshake thing and there's a lot of folks out there who, uh, who I, I can't wait to meet and do just that. But anyway, um, go ahead and send the emails to ben at observatoryproject.com. Uh, if you go to observatoryproject.com, uh, that was just easier to remember. It does redirect to uh, the website of mine that you've all uh, known uh, about for quite a while. And it's got a lot of information on there, and it'll have a lot of updates. I can't say there's going to be a lot of updates tonight or maybe even in the next couple of days, as many of you know. The Electric Universe Conference is this weekend. Uh, if any of you can get to Albuquerque or you happen to be in Albuquerque, Thursday night the opening is free to everyone. Uh, and that's where uh, you know Dave Talbot, Walt Thornhill, and I will be speaking uh, kind of as you know to cap off the, the opening. And there's going to be a short question and answer as well. But so anyway, uh, we'll be leaving to go there tomorrow. Uh, while we're in New Mexico, uh, that is two hours behind where we are now. So I think it's safe to say that getting the evening, or I'm sorry, the morning news out uh, on time will be a bit of a challenge. Uh, just while we're at the conference, it absolutely will come out just probably an hour or two later. Uh, and just while we're at the conference there, um, tomorrow night and Thursday night, the night I'm speaking uh, for the website members it's going to be pretty tough to do an evening news update although uh, you know you know I'll be trying to do it if I can anyway we are up over our goal updates will be coming thank you all so so much really appreciate it be safe everyone